is extremely confusing. This rental place is extremely confusing. The guy was like, hey, go to zone three, pick a car. Every rental I've ever done, seen, whatever, has always been like, yeah, here's your assigned vehicle kind of thing. But uh, no, we're in this sweet Elantra. Hold on, let me get out and look at y'all. Let y'all see this thing. So, I mean, it's kind of cool. But, uh, I'm already out of breath. Welcome to Colorado. Let's plug up to this car and we'll see what we're about to get into. I'm stopping real quick, grab some coffee. Oh, and I gotta grab some snacks because I'm starting to get really hungry. Just been on the run all morning. spot that I wanted to stop at and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and take the drone up. So, next stop is gonna be Breckenridge. Uh, I think it's gonna be like a 30 minute-ish drive. I don't know because there's no signal. But I'm pretty sure it's about 30 minutes-ish away and it's cool because I can't even check into my hotel until four. Uh, so that being said, more road trip. I'm headed up now on the gondola. Uh, if you've never ridden one, it's an experience. It's kinda sketch. Uh, but you also gotta understand this thing non-stop runs year-round, and it's just fine. Hopefully. And now we're riding the gondola back down. It's just as shaky as it was on the way up. Okay, so I've driven by this place twice now, and I'm curious. It looks good. I'm gonna go in and try it, and let's go. So stopped at this little produce stand and got, you know, a couple of peaches and stuff like that. And uh, the lady told me that peaches are in season. I mean, I had to try these little donut peaches. Uh, never had or seen something like this. So, yeah, if you're ever in, I don't even know what the name of this town is. Uh, but it's Palisade Peaches is, uh, is where these peaches are from. If you ever in this town, you have to. You have to stop. These are good. I uh, unpacked, set up my new like home base for the weekend here, for the, for the rest of the week, I guess. Uh, but now it's starting to settle in that I'm freaking starving. I've been traveling all day. So I'm gonna go get some food and uh, who knows from there? <laughs> I really kind of want to go hiking again. It was really nice out. And I mean, you're in Colorado. What else are you supposed to do other than hike, you know? All right, so where I'm staying at here in Dillon, uh, it's like Dillon, Silverthorne, and there's one more town just kind of stacked on top of each other. Uh, so I went and hit up this place called Fobe, and uh, the food that I got smells really good. This is the best taro pho, or pho, taro boba I've ever had, so. Cheers. We're actually filming tomorrow, but I'm about to go meet the couple at the location, look around, see what kind of lighting we've got. And the good thing about our timing on it today is actually gonna be, big enough to bang my 
is actually going to be that with similar scenario tomorrow, time-wise, I can go ahead and send the drone up today and get a lot of footage and have it knocked out. I don't even have to think about it tomorrow when we're actually filming the actual ceremony itself. like a massive just valley. So I'm gonna send the drone into it. All right, we just finished up location scouting. We got everything situated. We know what we're gonna be doing tomorrow, or at least the location. Um, so now I'm just gonna go back, I'm gonna eat, and I'm gonna edit some. Might go into town and find a drink or something, I don't know yet. We'll see. We'll see. Real quick, just wanna say, look at this. Just look at this. Look at what I get to do because I have a camera in my hands. Look at all this. Look at all this. It almost looks fake back over like through there. But all this I get to do because I shoot cool videos. How, oh, how cool is that? How cool is that? Thing about Colorado, that's during the day it gets very comfortable outside. Out here in the mornings, it's like a brisk 75 degrees, and uh, this is the type of weather that I live for, and it's just year-round in the summers here. So just for a quick second, we're going to ignore that I just said it's year-round in the summers here. <laughs> I'm still waking up. I'm about to go find a coffee shop somewhere here. Um, one thing I love about Colorado, <laughs> all the things I love about Colorado, Colorado's great. If you've never been, you need to go. But uh, there's a lot of cool coffee shops, so I'm going to try and find me some coffee as my wake-up alarm goes off. So, uh, yeah. So. Oh. Coffee shop was cool as shit. Rather rightfully, rightfully to be called the House of Vibes. And uh, the espresso's still too hot, but I got an Americano. Didn't want anything too heavy, but uh, cheers. All right, anyways, burrito secured, ow. Burrito secured, put that in the cup holder. We've got the ultimate breakfast lineup going here. Americano. So now I just got one more stop. One more stop and we're done. So the cool thing about Colorado is there's a lot of cars that are like prototypes that get tested here. And uh, there's one right here. All right, we got breakfast, we got coffee, and we got some waters and other beverages. <clears throat> By the beverages, I mean like Electrolytes and then a monster, just in case I run out of gas today. But, um, I don't even know what time it is. It's like not even 9 o'clock yet. It's almost 9 o'clock, so by the time I get back and eat, it'll be about time to start partying. It's going to be a busy day. I'm excited. kind of nervous. My first elopement to film. But look at this view out here. Just look at all the mountains. Hold on. I'm gonna fix it. Look at all the mountains out there. Everything here's packed. That's ready to run. Those are ready to run. This is all situated. I'm uh, I'm packed. I'm ready to go film. I, uh, I'm just gonna go adventure some, you know, and enjoy myself while I'm in here. So that being said, I'll catch up with y'all when it's time to actually film the wedding. So 
So I just got back from Breckenridge with everybody. And uh, I've got about 20 minutes-ish before I gotta get ready and go. The vlog portion of this is gonna get a little fewer and far between as I actually start working. Um, but yeah. Congratulations to Kyle and Cheyenne. <laughs> they were the lovely couple that invited me to come out and do this for them. And I couldn't have been happier because, I mean, look at, look at everything. This is amazing. So, yeah. Oh. <laughs> 